there, I'm Brian Taylor with Highway RV in Lake Alfred, Florida. Today I want to take you on a quick uh, look at this 2008 North Shore by Dutchman. It's a 31 RG floor plan. So we're going to start the tour indoors and then we'll come on to the outside. Okay, so this is the inside of our 2008 North Shore by Dutchman. Again, it's the 31RG floor plan, which features three slide outs. This coach weighs about 9,500 pounds, so it's not super heavy. Um, it's also a really nice size for maneuverability. It's going to tow really nice, and you don't need a huge uh, dually truck to pull it or anything like that. But what I really like about this floor plan, we've sold one of these before and did really well with it. It's got a really unique floor plan. The living room down here is sunken, and the uh, kitchen is raised up a little bit, and it gives it a really nice residential feel, and it's something that sets it off just a little bit different than your average floor plan that you see. It gives it a little bit of character, something a little bit different from the norm. So I'm going to start here in the kitchen and kind of show you some of the stuff that we got here. Uh, we'll start here with you got a bar top right here uh, that, that you can uh, serve uh, food from there. Um, we've got a double bowl sink, uh, double bowl sink up here in the kitchen. All of the countertops are Formica with a nice wood bull nose uh, on, the, on the edge. The, the Formica is in excellent shape. All of the cabinetry is in really good shape in this coach. It's also got a uh, laminate floor in it that's kind of a, almost kind of looks like an oak, um, possibly a hickory kind of a look. Uh, gives it a nice, a warm, a homey feel again also. Uh, it's all in really good shape. Here we got a three burner cooktop right here with an oven. And of course we got our microwave up above and this is a convection microwave so not only can you bake in the oven you can also bake in the convection microwave. Lots and lots and lots of counter space back here. This is a really great kitchen for cooking in. Uh, if you got families or uh, you just like to cook you got a, you got a lot of, of counter space here as much as some apartments. Um, you've got a nice two-door refrigerator here that's in excellent condition. It's not rusty in there or anything like that. And we got a nice freestanding dinette over here with leather uh, seating surfaces. Got a nice, uh, nice fixtures, nice lighting fixtures in here. Plenty of windows. So if this would be your patio side, if you were set up at the campground, so you have a nice view of your patio uh, while you're sitting here eating. And so we'll come on down here into the living area, and it steps down probably about a foot. And what you're going to notice is we have a leather sofa uh, with a with a full uh, pull-out sleeper sofa. We've got two of what I call European-style loungers. They're they're basically a recliner with a separate ottoman. Uh, so you got a really nice congregating area right here. A huge window over here with our pleated shade uh, that would open up onto the patio. That's a nice uh, nice view of the patio there. We have a Vizio flat screen television here. We've also got a DVD player down here and a stereo. Got plenty of cabinetry in this coach all around. So let's go on up here into the bedroom. <coughs> and up in here we have our, our, our bedroom with a slide out. The bed is in the slide out right here. Um, there's a little bit of carpet back here. It's really the only place in the coach that has carpet and it's in nice shape. It's not stained up or ripped or torn or anything like that. We've got a nice big uh, wardrobe back here. They've added some shelves in here to have a little bit more stacking area. We've got another television. It is a tube style television back here. Uh, kind of a little, uh, little area here where you could probably put a laptop or maybe you could even put your TV over here if you wanted a little larger TV. Um, I'm going to let you step on by. You can rotate around. We've got a corner um, sink right here with a nice medicine cabinets and lots of uh, mirrors around it. Countertops are in excellent condition. More of that, that laminate flooring up in here, all of it which is in, in really nice shape. And then we've got our nice big corner glass enclosed shower right here. Really, uh, really clean. Everything's in operating condition. We don't know of anything that's at all wrong with this uh, with this trailer. Uh, it does have a separate toilet room right here, so you do have privacy for the toilet room. Uh, so uh, this is the inside of the coach. So let's go on head on around to the outside, and I'll show you a little bit of what's going on out there. Okay, so this is the outside of our North Shore by Dutchman. Um, all of the front cap is really shiny on this. The graphics are all good and sharp. 
Um, no, nothing wrong up here. Everything looks great. All of the graphics down the side and on both sides of the coach are in really nice condition. They don't show any, uh, on this side, they don't show any fading or cracking or curling. Uh, coming back from the front, we do have an electric awning here, so this is a power awning. That's really a nice feature to have. Of course, we have our electric power jacks in the front uh, when you're hitching and unhitching. Got really large pass-through storage bay right here. This goes all the way through to the other side. Something I did not point out when we were inside is it does have central vac. This Dirt Devil um, box right there is the central vacuum system for this coach. So it, that's also a nice uh, feature that you only see a lot of times on higher end uh, coaches. And this is a nice affordable unit. Um, got our triple stairs right there. Our tires are in excellent condition. They show no evidence of any, um, any weather checking. I believe these were about uh, a year old or so. I, don't quote me on that. If you, if you want to confirm that, uh, give me a call and I'll do, do the research on that uh, between now and then. But they're in perfect condition. The tread is great on them. And, and like I said, I believe they're newer. Uh, we've got nice big windows on this. Here's the, the, the passenger side slide out on this. So let's go on around to the rear. All the sidewalls are firm on this coach. There is no evidence of any leaking. There's no evidence of any delamination. Uh, all of the caps are good and tight. This back cap is tight. It's not let go or anything. That's something you need to look for when you're looking at especially towables, we find. Uh, the, the, uh, a lot of times you'll see these back and front caps are, are, are kind of loose. Uh, but this one's in really great shape. Uh, again, shiny, no damage, no nicks, scratches, or anything like that. Um, super, super shiny and glossy. Coming on around to this side, um, the graphics are not fading. They aren't um, checking or anything. There is a minor amount of shrinkage on the silver. Um, there's actually, it's pulling back. Here's about the worst spot on the coach. We're pulling back maybe of a quarter of an inch right here. They can be trimmed up and cleaned up. Uh, but those, those are the only stripes on the coach that are showing any wear or tear. It's this silver color. The gold looks really nice, uh, and it's, it's just the swoop that kind of comes down the middle here. Here's our uh, other uh, dining, or our, um, this is our um, living room slide out on the driver's side. Again, all the fiberglass is in great shape all the way around on this. You can see we don't have, uh, the, the, the graphics are not bad at all on this coach because this, this, this uh, name here, the sign is still really great. All of these graphics are sharp. It's really only that one stripe that has some shrinkage on it. Really minor for an 08. Overall, I'm, this coach has got to be, uh, you know, an eight and a half, nine on the 10 scale. It's about as, uh, it's, it's just a super clean coach, about as clean as they come for a used coach. Um, so if, I hope this, this has been helpful for you. I hope it's answered some of your questions. If you have any more questions about the coach, please feel free to call me anytime. My name's Brian Taylor. Again, we're, we're Highway RV. If you want to reach me, my telephone number is 863-956-1036. And uh, thank you for taking the time to watch this video, and you have a great day, and God bless.